Hey y'all, this is Diane with Real Three High Priestess. This is a reading for Scorpio, someone rising to be a sign. I, am, I got a fever, y'all. I don't know what's happening right now. My hands are so sweaty and I just don't feel good. So I just wanted to let you guys know if the reading is kind of, it's not gonna be off. It might be a little slow though, okay? Let's jump in. This is for July 2019. Someone rising to Venus sign. Let's let's look inside. The five of Pentacles here and the Five of Swords. You're jumping off with the fives, okay? Jumping off with change here. You're changing your mind about something. Some situation here. That's what I'm saying. Something that had you feeling troubled in regards to money or her, how you had a relationship with someone in regards to money okay that's what I'm seeing here the universe is bringing in some change and moving things around that's what I feel when I see the fives all right what's going on with Scorpio July 2019. What are they preparing themselves for? Our... Thank you. Page of Cups here. Okay. The Five of Cups here in reverse. They're both in reverse. The Four of Wands here at the heart of the matter. You have the Five of Swords again. Upright this time. Six of Pentacles here in reverse. Okay. Under the deck, you have the Knight of wands look at you walking okay but you could be walking into a lot of additional issues here in july okay something that could be conflicting in your mind um you have to move it out of your way that's what i'm feeling okay and i feel like you have the power to actually do this and bring balance back into your life into your home okay <laughs> into your circle of people that you deal with i feel like you're ready to move forward let's look at something here let's put your five your knight of wands here you guys got the five of wands right under that in reverse here your circle the circle of people that you're around okay watch out for people that want to talk slick to you okay that always have something to say and cause conflict around you that's what i'm hearing okay I feel like they want to kind of dictate your life because they can't live it. They bring a lot of imbalance to the plan. You're being told, hey, keep it moving. You have something else that you're supposed to be doing here with the Knight of Wands, okay? This journey, this journey, Scorpio, involves you being creative. You cannot be creative and have chaos around you or disruption. This is what you're trying to or you need to move away from, okay? I'm speaking on a higher level here. I don't even think this is about love with the individual person. I feel like it can be in your circle, okay? And the circle of people that you're around and who you involve yourself with, okay? These could be negative messages or just someone gossiping as well. This could be in your close friends or acquaintances at work or people you just have to deal with at work here. You have three fives here, okay? They're saying it's time for change at this moment. Let's take a look at this a little closer, okay? Of course, I'm going to go in a little deeper. 
I'm gonna look at your fives here and see where you're being pulled to, Scorpio. Where you should be focusing your attention to make this change, okay? Because I feel like even in the past positions here, these people did not appreciate you, whoever you are around, okay, from the get-go, all right? There's some sense of you feeling like an outsider from the beginning. That's going to change. You have the Page of Cups here. In reverse in the five of whew, five of cups here. I feel like there was some lack of satisfaction or faithfulness from this dark haired man. Okay, that's what that is saying. Like there was lack of direction in the relationship, okay? You have the consultant here and the lawyer that just popped out. So the three of pentacles here, I just feel like, oh yeah. Mm. <laughs> Somebody's married to someone. Someone's looking into, um, man, this is so crazy. Why does this always gotta be like this? Okay. Something about where you are in your home. This, this is like slipping into partnership, okay? You guys could have a close circle of friends that you're not quite sure about either, okay? You could be talking to someone and they are relaying messages or gossiping about you and your relationship. That's what I'm seeing here, okay? Like, you're confiding in people. And they're running back telling motherfuckers, okay? It's creating delays in what you're trying to do, okay? Okay? This person is like picking up a rock and throwing it at this person. They're just running away. Okay. That's what this five of swords is making me feel like. That's what we're looking at here, Scorpio. So be careful who you speak to about your relationship, your marriage, and who you confide in. Okay. Because this person may not bring the truth. That's why you have the ace of spades here, which is the ace of swords. Okay. They may not be that friend, that person. All right. Somebody's going to be speaking to someone about a lawyer. That's what I'm seeing. Let's see what's going to be going on further here. Why is the six of principles here? Reverse. Ooh, someone has a very, very arrogant type of energy here. That you're trying to seek... That you're trying to escape. That's what I'm hearing, okay? That Six of Pentacles making me feel like you feel cheated from this person. But they stand on their word. They're like, hey, I'm just going to stand on this, all right? Because that's how he's standing there like, huh? I ain't cheat you. I ain't take that. I didn't do that. <laughs> that's what I'm feeling here, okay? This is like king, the King of Pentacles I'm feeling, okay? Oh, that's how they see themselves, but this is how you're seeing them. This is how you're feeling here, Scorpio, okay? But they may not be as fair. That's why you have the Knight of Wands here. You're looking towards the future. Someone may be just moving and relocating, traveling just to find themselves, taking a vacation without the boo or just, well, I say without the boo. <laughs> be careful with, around your circle, though. That's what's going on here. Okay, you're trying to find this escape or find a new inspiration or love for your creative life. Okay, but you're hanging around the wrong circle here. Okay, there are some serious personality clashes going on here with whoever you're dealing with, okay? There's some power plays, but you may not see it. You're kicking it with them. That's what I'm feeling here, okay? Be careful of the company that you keep. That's what I'm hearing here, okay? You look at y'all traveling, going on a journey, and you think that they're trying to help you, but it ain't quite so, I'm feeling. It's not quite so, all right? Yeah. Card that just fell out is enemy. 
That's what I'm talking about, okay? You can overcome this though. You just have to pay attention. Let's go in. Let's go in a little deeper, okay? look at your love a little deeper here Scorpio okay let's give my cards for Scorpio I just saw the deception card be careful of deception and people that are around you okay all right that's where we are all right so you have unrequited love here there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going release your ex it's time to bypass all these people okay all these relationships that you don't need you have past life relationships you have known each other before are you interested in someone yeah. okay make the effort we're just looking at your love here okay this could be with someone that you're currently with trying to get away from because you know there's not a strong connection, okay? Here. Let's take a look. I'm gonna use some playing cards, okay? And take a look at this unrequited love for you, Scorpio. there's some truth coming maybe you're gonna deliver it okay maybe you're gonna be very 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 blunt with someone you're gonna get very very clear about how you feel about a situation look at that yes the page of swords and the ace of swords you're like look i'm gonna make this plain and clear okay there's not enough attraction unrequited love with whoever you're dealing with right now whoever this lover is here okay Ooh. release your ex mm. you don't need anyone to come <laughs> okay get it together you do not need anyone to come and save you okay that's what I'm feeling here of swords here someone's gonna try to come and save you or come console you someone from the past okay that's what i'm feeling here in that situation with this 10 of past life relationship <laughs> all right look at you you are moving um uh, towards something here. I feel like you're trying to move towards another lover that's going to make you feel emotionally happy here, Scorpio, or does. You may be talking to this person right, right now. That's what I'm feeling. This could be a Pisces that you're dealing with, that you connect with on emotional you have some really intellectual conversations with them. That's why I feel like you're connecting with them in this way, okay? You have known each other before. That's what I'm feeling here, okay? There's some sense that you can leave this... Uh, I'm not even going to say victim met mentality, okay? Okay? That's why I say you don't need to be saved. I know this sounds weird, okay? But I, I feel like some of my Scorpios are currently in a relationship knowing that it's not going to work, okay? You're conversating with someone. You're trying to connect with someone. And I don't feel like it's purpose. It's on purpose. I just feel like there is some spiritual connection here, some emotional connection that you have with someone else, okay? Okay? 
And I feel like you are giving off the energy of being very independent, being very uh, strong, okay? And this is attracting people to you. It's attracting exes back to you, okay? You know that you want to be loved. That's why you have the card of make the effort, okay? Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. You know this already, okay? You have the six of wands here, okay? And this is why you're taking these steps. You have the six of hearts here, okay? This is that past lover that you're thinking of. You're standing on it, all right? Not an ex. When I say past lover, is someone that you feel connected with spiritually, like you've known this person before. That's why you have this card, that type of connection, okay? Like, oh my God, like I feel them on an energetic type of level, very spiritual. I feel like it's another water sign that you are connecting with here. Mm -hmm. All right, let's take a look at the Let's get some advice for you. Advice, advice. Spirit and the guys are most high. Let's get the cards for Scorpio. July 2019. What advice do you have for my Scorpios? Thank you. for help hmm. not from just anybody okay do something for someone else these cards are, are a little fluffy for me you guys embrace your emotions okay I'll take a look at them ask for help okay what it what is it you really need help with be willing to allow yourself the support you need I feel like it's spiritual support you need though, okay? And be careful of the company that you keep and I'm still standing on that, okay? Be careful of who you share your information with, all right? Especially when you're on a vacation, tripping, drinking, you just oh, da, 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 chatting it up. Yeah, be careful. Because somebody in your crowd is like leaking water, okay? Can't hold water. Do something for someone else. Give your attention to someone else. You're probably doing that already. All right. Embrace your emotions. Don't push down your feelings or judge your emotions. So they're like live free. Okay. Someone might just open up and tell someone how you feel. And it was a confidential type of conversation. Okay. And you are feeling like I didn't tell you that just to go and run back and tell everybody else. So be careful of who you ask this help from. Okay. Or confide in going off my intuition here because these cards are fluffy so I gotta go in a little bit deeper when I deal when I deal with them okay I'm gonna do something that I don't normally do and I'm gonna get some messages for your lover at this point okay I want to know how Scorpio's lover is feeling Lover Scorpio, okay. Thank you. I can't seem to find the right words to say to you. I've looked you up online to see what you've been up to. <laughs> you are an angel. All right. So that's your cards here from your lover. I want to pull one more. Your intensity frightens and allures me all at the same time. This person is just connected as you are.
person watches you as well. I'm just getting one more message to leave you guys off with. Ooh, just said 1919 on the time here. I see a start to a new journey for you here. Scorpios, a start to a new journey. Be careful as you move to the next level in this journey here, okay? Your advice here, be, is what I just said, basically, new birth, okay? This new birth, guarded vigilantly. So guarded vigilantly, that's what it's saying here. Your new life is in need of attention and care. This new relationship that you're trying to form needs your attention and care, okay? Your ideas, your creativity that you're trying to bring forth um, that I spoke about, okay? It needs to be nurtured at this time, okay? It holds a special purpose for your life path, so take care of it. You're being told here, okay? Keep your inner sanctuary pure, okay? Don't let nobody fool around in there, okay? Keep your mind, <laughs> your body, um, your living space um, clutter-free um, and free of negativity and negative energy, okay? You're being told to move without fear, okay? And re remove things without fear as you need to, okay? That This includes any emotional baggage that's cluttering up your temple here, okay? That is your reading, Scorpio, for July 2019. Thank you guys so much for coming back to watch your reading. Give me a thumbs up for this video. I do appreciate it. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified of videos that I put out for July. I will be back with you guys, okay? Like, subscribe, and share. And if you're looking for a reading, you can go to www.303highpriestestarot.com. Love you. Bye.